At 12, I swore the oath, leaving home and family. At 16, I saw my master die. I took up his shield and his name, and on that day, I became a crusader. Armored by faith, driven by duty, bound to kill the enemies of Zakarum. Sworn to live as a crusader and to die as one. Now, corruption returns to the hearts of men. I see it in the eyes of the mad. Hear it in the howling of the damned. A falling star in the west leads me to the town of New Tristram. The crusade calls me. And so, I go. Fallen Star is close, but there is death here, too. Greetings. I am a crusader of the Zakarum faith, and I saw a star falling on this town. It fell on the old cathedral. There was only one survivor, Leah. You should speak with her. Captain Rumford, more dead are coming. We can't open the gates until we drive them back. They keep coming. <laughs> Never seen anyone fight like that before. Guards, user open entered the your channel. You'll find Leah at the slaughtered calf inn. It's an arg. What's up, Sam? What up? So guess what? What's up? We get a wild star weekend this weekend too. I know. Yeah, I'm excited. Should be fun. Zacharum Did you hear about Guild Wars? Too? What fate ah. save us now? We I'm will now excited. have a count wide die, so we will now have a war yeah. system. Yeah, and they also unveiled today that uh, I can't wear legendaries and ascended gear too. Yep. And I can't wear world world PVP or world 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 versus world experience. I mean. Seems to change yes. new Tristram, does it? What do you mean? Lost I see you're making a crusader. I am. It's pretty amazing. I love it. Looks. Fun. My crusader is 55 right now. Yeah. That was fast. Well, is, is there an EXP yeah. game going on or something? Um, no, I... <laughs> so the trick is, and I didn't think about this, this is actually a heal contribution, so you thank him for this. It worked great, though, because <laughs> I actually did normal all the way up until about 20. Um, the idea is, in... Well, first of all, it works It works better, obviously, if you've leveled to 70, which means you start. You can start getting the Imperial Rubies and stuff like that. Um, so the idea is... Right. No, 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 not the helmet. You get a weapon. It doesn't matter. The original, initially, it doesn't matter what the DPS is for the weapon. Just get a weapon with the socket in it, and then put a imperial, like an imperial ruby in it, which for the weapon gives you 190 damage. At low level, 190 damage is a ridiculous amount of damage, so you just wreck stuff, like just all over the place. You can go in and do master, which is a higher, higher. Um, well, you need to get 60 first, but for you, um, but Master is a higher level of, um, actually, no, you, Master, you just have to beat the game once, never mind, so you probably already have it, no. but yeah, you go into Master and just wreck stuff in Master, because even in Master, like, with your kind of damage you would have on that weapon, you just, you can destroy everything, and I mean, you may die here and there because they still do a lot of damage, um, but yeah, you can do it, um, and just in leveling, because I... All, all I did was 
after, at a certain point in time, I think it was even during the middle of Act 2, I switched over, and by the time that I got by it to the end of Act 5, my guy was already, like, level 50. So it just works a lot. It just you can learn levels really, really fast by doing that. And then once I mean, once you start getting around fifty, it starts getting even. Obviously, Act Five also it's how um, things start dying less fast. Um, did you join a public game? Yeah, by accident, I was messing with something. I need to do that. Um, in any case, um, after that point in time, then in Reaper of Souls, one of the uh, one of the secondaries you can get is um, a thing so you can lower your level, the level requirement, like I have a weapon right now, it's actually technically a weapon this. for... It was on my okay. warrior, it's a, wep it's a weapon that like requires level 60, but it's actually a weapon requirement allows it to be level like 20 something. Yeah, so I got a level 70 weapon, but I have it so it says level requirement reduced by 29, which means that my character can use it at 41. So now I'm going through Master again, wrecking stuff still because I have a really stupid power weapon that I shouldn't be able to have to try and get to 70 which is funny because I just kept going on this guy I haven't stopped because I just I love the crusader is amazing that's fun and another big change for us this weekend is the level requirement is 20 instead of 17 under siege for six days now. yes See, that's why that's why I thought someone had said that there, that there was going to be a progressive change. No, this is oh, this is not a progressive change. They are still keeping it at twenty. It's just that they got to, took the feedback of people saying, "Okay, why seventeen? Why not twenty? So we can at least do dungeons." Well, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use my stalker then. Well, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna level up my my Esper so I can do dungeons. Because I mean, that's the thing. I just want to be able to try dungeons out. Like, I don't care if it's twenty and it stays twenty until we go until we get the game. But I just want to be able to try dungeons, and it's, it was dumb that 17, you could do dungeons, you just have to join a group. Like, you know, it's like, I don't, I want it to be, hold on. Hold on. Okay, sorry. I like the fact that it changed to 20 because then at least I could do dungeons. Like, I just didn't understand what their whole idea was. Do 17 because I want to be able to, you know, if I don't have friends on, I don't know anybody, I want to still be able to queue up for a dungeon. And you can't queue up until 20. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm fine with having it be 20 because that gives me plenty of time to level everything everything else up and experience everything at, through the, the basic things other than the raids that you can do. They are the remnants of Queen Asilla's slaughtered handmaidens who were twisted by foul magic. Now they feast upon cadavers and regurgitate them. As yeah, been through Reaper of Souls now on both my wizard at you know level cat, you know going from sixty to seventy, and then also on my crusader being a lower level but still going through it. I must wait longer. Uh, have you have you even no you haven't have you gotten to sixty on character yet? Nope. Once you get to sixty and you can start doing Reaper of Souls, well, once you well you can technically go and do it now as long as you kill Diablo you can just go and do Reaper of Souls and the bosses are kind of kind of kind of jerks <laughs> like they're not the e they're not easy bosses at all like yeah granted I haven't been doing any of them on normal I've been doing them on like expert or master and they're just they're definitely not fun. I mean, they're fun because they're hard, but it's just like, yeah, a lot of dying. A lot of really scary fights, too, because it's like there's so much that just kills you instantaneously on, um, you know, Expert and Master. But yeah, I, I saw that and I was like, that makes me excited, like... I was really bummed because like I really, really want to be able to play Wildstar this weekend. And I came home today and I was like, oh look, I get to play Wildstar this weekend. That's awesome. Yep, they gave us some stuff. Yeah, I'm I'm really happy they finally made it so that dies will be account wide because it's just the stupidest thing. It's like, okay, I don't want to have to unlock dies on every single character. Yeah. What do you mean all the skills? All the skills. Oh, skins, yeah. So no more need for those chances. Can't white transmog. Nothing stops 
You still need transmutation stuff. For certain things, but not for like the skins I got unlocked there. No, you still need a transmute to transmute into different, different things. It showed it in the UI that you still use transmutes. Yeah, but you don't waste anything, that's what I mean. You have, like, if you want oh, yeah. to get it back. Yeah, you just have to have transmute stuff should, to do yeah, it. Yeah, this is a currency. Right, that, which is, you know, much better. But yeah, um, great idea if you want to level really fast in Diablo 3. Other thing, is, um, it's really awesome that I love about Diablo 3 is that um, as long as you've unlocked it on some character, well, actually, their, their transmog is amazing. Like, you just earn transmog even if you haven't ever, like, gotten some of the pieces just by leveling the Mystic up. So, like, even if it's, like, a level 1 character, if you want to spend the money on it, because, you know, you have a count wide gold as well, if you want to spend the money on transmogging somebody into, uh, I don't know, gear that looks like you're level 70, you can. So I've been looking awesome the entire game. Got a sweet looking shield too. And closed beta is out for landmark. You need to get in there and make your claim, dude. We, me and Keel already got our claims. And you actually have to make your your flag, so if you want to do that, I can get on there. Well, you you already have the pick too. You can get the requirements real quickly. Yeah, this time they don't give you the flag. You actually have to make your flag. Which should I get? Um, <laughs> so funny story. We originally started out on advent on courage, um, but apparently somehow we got switched to adventure. Me and Hill don't know what happened because we both remember going to Courage, but for some reason we like logged out and when we got, we got kicked out and then we logged back. Well, well I, I don't know what happened, but I logged out and I logged back in and apparently we're on Adventure Estuary. It was a snow server. So the servers are changed based on the environment. So they do have snow now. Well, it's a snow. It's so originally they only had like the you know the forest desert and then there was the jungle, or snow jungle areas. Now apparently with the closed beta they switched it up so now you can have like snow desert and you know other, you know, any combination of the four different things together. So, I don't know, let me check to see what, what's going on with that. Because remember when we started in the alpha, like it, there was already a whole bunch of places taken, taken up already? Mm -hmm. Yeah, um... It obviously wasn't that bad yesterday when me and Keel were getting on, but you weren't around. So I was really like, I was really hoping you had gotten on because we could have gotten acclaimed by us. But let me see what's available around us. But yeah, uh, basically, what I've noticed from going from alpha to closed beta. They basically changed everything. So you know, the, the, what it costs to do, to make things before is completely different. Less, like more. Not really less. Just.